Well, hello there, Ray. Oh, hey, Chessa. You know, we need to talk about the upcoming Darnell fundraiser. Well, are you an early riser? Because if you are, we can always go to Diamond Tie, which is up on the point on Raymond Avenue. Oh. They've got this view of the city that is really just out of this world. Wow, that sounds like a time. But you know, we could always wed chat. You know, instead, I am just so busy. Don't you think it's kind of a shame this Jessica girl's promoting this as a one-man show? Ugh. I mean, it's kind of well, just pitiful. The whole night has just been me, 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 oh, me, me. She's not so bad. She's just you know, trying to find a way like everybody else. Some artists get you know overly excited when it comes to showing their work. I believe she'll, she'll find her center. Everybody deserves a chance, right? Uh, hold your applause to the end. Uh, this will be a landmark in the art community. And while society can continue to regress and devolve right before our very eyes, I will continue to push forward for you guys. Without artists like myself, society as a whole would absolutely be lost. So, without further ado, Okay. What do you want? You know, just there was nothing wrong with your piece. <laughs> Art is subjective. I mean, if you love it, that's what matters. You love it, I, right? I don't know. I don't know. I try, you know, really hard to make it seem like I know what I'm doing, but I'm just scared and I'm really, really embarrassed. Every time I sit down to you know, work, I remember that I can make whatever I want. A blank canvas, an empty page. That's absolute freedom. Do I ever make something because it'll make you happy? Not for anybody else? I think I used to. Yeah. I've got this painting hanging up in my house, and it's not one of my best, it's not even one of my favorites, but it's my mom's favorite. So I haven't sold it or thrown it out or anything because it's this reminder that no matter what, no matter if I think it's worthy of anything, somebody out there will find it important. I guess. I guess I just thought that if I wanted to be successful, you know, I, I had to stand out. Like, like if I pretended to believe in myself enough, eventually they would too. And I guess I just got carried away somehow. And I thought that fame was gonna bring like all this other stuff. That's all there is. There isn't any more. Fame's empty. You never cared about that, did you? <laughs> you were just being yourself and playing your... My ukulele. Yeah. <laughs> you got so many people's attention just because you were being you. I really admire that. 
really, I don't show it very well, but I do. So. Do you want to come upstairs with me? Uh, in a minute. That was an amazing performance. Uh, thank you. Thanks for coming out tonight. Yeah, no, I really want to do a write-up in City Source. Um, I just I want to tell everybody about the fish head and <laughs> and your performance and just what it means. Wow, uh, great. Yeah, great. Thanks. We should get together. Although, um, actually, you know, do you know Libby? She's yeah. really amazing, really talented artist, and you should interview her. She's got a really good story. I think. Uh, the way she approaches art could be really dynamic for you. Alright, well that sounds like a really great idea, Chessa, and you did a great job today. Thanks.